Hello and welcome back to Citizen Pew. This is Citizen Pew Commentary. And as you saw in the thumbnail, I'm going to be talking about a particular firearm that has made, um, you know, a little ruckus on the internet lately, uh, in the last couple days. Um, I think the two videos I've watched it are from Reno May and um, the Yankee Marshal. And I... I saw their videos and I said, well, let me look into this here, see what's going on, right? I read a lot of the comments in their, uh, in their videos and I said, you know what, yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, um, to put one together on this. So, as you saw in the thumbnail, uh, it was a picture of the Beretta uh, pistol that uh, Beretta worked with in uh, collaboration with um, Jeffree Star. Now... I didn't know who Jeffree Star was until I saw the first video um, and watched it. And then I was like, oh, okay, that's who they are, right? And I saw the pistol and uh, I was like, interesting. Let's see what this is all about, right? And um, now don't get me wrong, um, I like Beretta. I do. I like Beretta products. And um, the Beretta pistol that you know, they made for Jeffree Star. I can appreciate the craftsmanship. I definitely can, but it's not quite my style. Not quite my style. But you know what? Um, I've seen firearms that are pink sold before in multiple colors and stuff like that. There's a lot of women I know who, who have uh, very, very flashy firearms. So to me, it was just like, okay, no biggie, right? So let's look further into what this whole controversy is about. And I saw, um, I, I guess there was a few comments I saw where they were upset with Beretta catering to celebrities. And um, I was like, yeah, yeah, companies cater to celebrities all the time. What are you talking about, right? Um, I mean, that's capitalism, right? They're a private company and they want their brand to be known. Lots of private companies use celebrities to help bring um you know attention to their products so i'm like i don't see the problem there right it's no different than uh, a chip manufacturer hiring an actor to put on the cover of a chip to sell it right so there you go so i, I don't see why that's a, a big issue and i didn't see a whole lot of comments about people upset with Brett about that but there was a there was some and i was like yeah okay whatever right I've had comment, people comment in my comment section where I make comments. They're like, what are you against capitalism? I'm like, well, no, but I guess if you took it that way. So the way I'm taking it, I'm, I'm not against capitalism. And to me, that's capitalism. Free market. They can do and make what they want. And Jeffree Star can buy and ask somebody to make what they want. I don't know. There you go. So, um, so I, 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 I didn't see any issue there, right? And so it came down to two things that I could see what the controversy was about, right? It was either um, Jeffree Star or the firearm. And like I said, seeing how other firearms of that nature that are, or that are very flashy and stuff like that exist, and I haven't seen controversy about that, I guess it's coming down to the controversies about Jeffree Star, right? Now... I have gone and tried to figure out where most of these negative comments are coming from. And there are some people in the firearms community that um, have said, you know, derogatory things towards Jeffree Star. But I think that's wrong. Um, you know, I'm willing to bet there's a lot of people who didn't know who Jeffree Star was, like I didn't, until this Beretta pistol showed up. So, um, you know... I'm just saying, right? Um, now, so let's look at this issue here um, with it being Jeffree Star. You know, is um, you know, is there a reason for the firearm community to be opposed to him um, buying a firearm? I don't think so. If you're a law-abiding citizen, I want you to exercise your right. Well, you know what I'm saying? And I've seen a little bit of controversy about thing. You know, people saying, "Well, yeah, they're a celebrity, but they're not." pro 2a they might be pro gun but you know what i mean at least they're not pro take everybody's guns away right i'm okay with somebody just being pro gun 
I honestly am. That's that's a lot bigger win than you know the 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 opposite of that. So I, I don't know, you know. So I was trying to figure out where all this controversy is coming from, and and you know you might say, well, it wasn't a whole lot, and I I, I agree. It, 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 there are bigger uh, scandals out there, but um, you know I I just um, and, and for the gun community. The firearms community, whatever, pro 2A groups and stuff like that. I, I think this is a great thing. I think it's a law-abiding citizen exercising their right. Awesome. And they, they just happen to be um, you know, famous and lucky enough to collaborate with Beretta to make something custom for them. I was like, spot on. Um, you know, I mean, if I, one, one, one day when I'm famous, I, don't get me wrong, I will be reaching out and saying, hey, can we make me something custom? Yeah, so I can't knock her, or uh, I can't knock Jeffree Star for that, right? So, um, plus I learned a little bit that, you know, um, Jeffree Star's uh, father was, uh, I guess, a big Beretta fan. And this was kind of like, almost like a, you know, uh, a tribute to him and stuff like that and that's cool you know i mean I, I i i know people who have firearms that have been handed down through generations so you know i get that so anyhow moving forward where did all this controversy come from right so well i'll tell you where it came from it came from the people who don't like the fact that anybody has a gun right i started looking at some of those comments and those people are brutal Holy cow. I was like, man. And I try, I honestly, I really try not to get political. I just want to be a firearms enthusiast, do my videos, have a good time, educate what it, when I can, show how to be safe when I can, and just present products and techniques or whatever, right? I'm not, I don't want to be political, but, you know, sometimes it, it, it creeps in. So, um, you know, I, I I just don't get what this is. So for those of you who maybe don't know who Jeff uh, who Jeffrey Star is, I, you know when I saw the first few videos and I started looking into this, I I pulled up some information on the web. I just did a web search. Who's Jeffrey Star, right? And and uh, I'm gonna I'm just gonna kind of run through a little bit of it just so you know who they are. So. Um, you know, I went to Wikipedia and, you know, born 1985, um, uh, is an American YouTuber, entrepreneur, makeup artist, a former singer, songwriter, and founder of Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Um, you know, released an album in 2009, some other stuff, some early life stuff. I'm like, okay, you know, there's a picture right there. Um, and I was like, okay, well, let's see what else there is. So I, I went to... The Jeffree Star Cosmetics website and you know looked at it to see what was going on and you know there's products here um, I didn't see the cleaver <laughs> that's cool <clears throat> anyhow uh, you know <clears throat> cosmetic products and stuff okay yeah they started a cosmetic that's entrepreneurship that's the American dream so I don't know why that was a big deal and then I went over to um, Instagram here and pretty much standard Instagram, you know, people put, posting pictures. I mean, there's some, uh, you know, there's some uh, risque pictures here. I don't think anything is not YouTube appropriate, but I was like, look at that. There's, there's the, uh, there's the firearm right there. Nice. And I'm not going to read these comments, um, because I, I, I don't want any of the disparaging ones to show up. Um, but look at that. There's another one. Firearm. Look at that. And there's there's a couple more here. Um, let me scroll down here. And like I said, you, you know these video, you know these images. You might be like, yeah, that's not my style. But you know, to each their own. Check this one out. Oh, that's a video. I didn't click on this one before. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of badass. I'm just saying. Excuse my language there. Um, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, I can dig that one. Nice. Um, and uh, let's see here. There was another one down here. There it is. Look at that. Bam. All right. So, yeah. Uh, you know, and then I went to, here's uh, Facebook. So, yeah, I, I don't want to see that. So, I mean, 
that's Jeffree Star. There you go. That's who they are. You know, that's their social media presence. <laughs> I mean, I, I thought that Instagram video was pretty cool, honestly. Um, but, you know, to each their own. That's my opinion, right? So when you saw the thumbnail, I wasn't asking a question, why? Why does this going to exist? Why is the current, you know, whatever. I was asking, why does it matter? This is a free, uh, you know, American citizen ex exercising their right to own a firearm. You know, as far as I can tell, they're not against me owning my firearms. So where's the problem? I don't see one. You know, I mean, Jeffrey Starr definitely um, lives a a a um, more. Um, hmm, I mean, a lot of colors in the in their attire. I'm more of a kind of a you know. Uh, jeans and t-shirt kind of guy so uh but you know like i said to each their own right so i don't know i didn't see any controversy on it so i, I was like you know i i, I just i i found it really annoying that um there was anything said about it i mean honestly to me this is this is a non-issue right so anyhow um I, I don't get it so like i said the thumbnail isn't asking why it's saying why well, it's an issue because, honestly, it is an issue because people who are anti-gun, anti-2A, took issue with it. And I, I, I really bet, I really believe they took issue with it because Jeffree Star represents something that they relate to, but doesn't fall in line with what they uh, believe. Well, you know what? Jeffrey Star is Jeffrey Star's own person, and you know they're free. They're free to live their life the way they choose, and purchase firearm and exercise that right. So anyhow, that's my video. Let me know what you think. Like I said, I didn't, I didn't know, I didn't even know who Jeffrey Star was until like two days ago. <laughs> I was like. What is this? And I saw, I saw, like I said, I uh, I can't remember which one I saw. I think I watched Yankee Marshall's video first, and I was like, what? And then I watched uh, Reno May. And I was just, I was like, what? So then I, you know, I pulled up social media and started looking through stuff, and I, I read through a lot of comments because I was like, really curious what was coming from both communities, other communities, and all that, and to see where the controversy is. And honestly, I mean, there's a couple on the on the gun in the gun. Uh, firearms community that were being a little, you know, hurt, but uh, I think most of it was coming from that other side. So, um, but to me, I was like, you know, good on Jeffree Star. Got a custom made firearm from Beretta. That is awesome in my mind. Not the not not the layout style I would have chose, but you know what? Like I said, to each their own. So, you know, anyhow. That's all I got for you. Let me know what you think about the video um, and the whole, I don't know, controversy, I guess, or this little whatever it is. Uh, you know, put a, down, a comment down in the comment section. So, yeah, we'll uh, mosey on from here. And, uh, yeah, y'all have a good day.